Turkuichi. Station Yurika 2, you can stop with Turkuichi. Okay, I will start the script now. Thank you, Lionel. It's my privilege to s proceed to the ham video transmitter's functional commissioning. I feel honored to inaugurate this new amateur radio educational facility, which will enhance space conversations between crew members and students. I congratulate ARIS for this acquisition, and I wish ham video long life and plenty of successful and fascinating school contacts. I have been asked to answer a series of questions, so uh, let's start. First question, is it noisy in Columbus? No, it is uh, very quiet and comfortable to work in Columbus. Second question, is there a constant airflow that one can feel? Yes, uh, we have intramodule and intermodule ventilation and we can feel constant airflow in the ISS. Third question, do you have a phone system aboard uh, for internal communications? Yes, uh, we have interphone system on board the ISS and we can talk with our crewmates in different modules. Fourth question, if you knock on the wall in one module, can it be heard in another module? No, it will be very difficult to hear it in another module. Fifth question, can you turn around without touching anything? Would you please show us? It's very easy, I can show you. Sixth question, what kind of fire extinguisher do you have on board? We have uh, three types of fire extinguishers. U.S. fire extinguishers use uh, carbon dioxide, and the Russian fire extinguishers use uh, water and foam. Seventh question, how, was, how would a toy helicopter behave aboard the ISS? Since we're in a weightlessness environment, uh, it will be uh, uh, keeping going up until it hits the ceiling or a wall. Eighth question, if you were to play cars, how would you keep the cars in place? We will need to use Velcro to keep the cars in place. Ninth question, do you experience static electricity effects? If so, are they, are they different from uh, what they are on Earth? Yes, uh, we do, and uh, it is similar to the static electricity on the ground. Tenth question, is Konstantin Tsiolkovsky's photo still on the wall in the service module? Yes, uh, in the service module, uh, we have other photos like uh, Yuri Gagarin and uh, Sergei Koryolev, in addition to uh, uh, Konstantin Tsiolkovsky. Eleventh question, if you had to show school children or students something special about microgravity, what would you show? Okay, uh, with me, I have a, a drink water bag. So I will show you a bubble, water bubble here. In zero gravity, it will become a sphere. Here you can see. There's a small air bubble inside of the wall about water bubble. and I will let it flow and swallow it, airborne. That's your gravity. How did you enjoy the demonstration of zero gravity? I am so glad that, that I am talking with you uh, through the hand video. Okay, copy that, uh, Lionel. I have uh, completed uh, uh, all the uh, uh, demonstration and then uh, questions uh, that I had. Okay, quickly, you can continue until the end of the past in about 30 seconds.
Okay, copy that. So uh, I have been using the uh, ham radio here in the Columbus module. We have uh, ham radio equipment. I have uh, made uh, probably about uh, 15 school contacts uh, on this flight uh, since November, and it was always very uh, delightful to be able to talk with the students and.